this was before I've been around to a stolen ambulance call and I have a level 47 with me. This was before I do have eyes on the vehicle. It's gonna be going northbound, southbound lanes of travel. It's gonna be a white male, dark tank top, it looks to be a American flag shorts or pants, running northbound 096. Yeah, that's what it was. We got LSP notified about this. 1080 at this time, eastbound 300, Joshua Road. The rights onto Marina. He's still making rights, going on in circles at this time, going back towards Joshua. Made a left onto Joshua, going eastbound. Now you passed us. Uh, 255, this closer. Show us your fucking hands, bro. Hands, do not move. Show us your hands. This one for I got one at that point. What is going on, y'all? It's your boy CEO Phil back at it again with another video. It's been about three months, y'all. It's been a while, but I'm back. Hoping to create more content for you guys. And in today's episode, we are in my server, Crystal World, roleplay 2.0, operating as the San Andreas State Police. It'll be a little bit different. Uh, we're gonna be running as the MCCD and as well as a regular unit. Again, it's some good scenes today. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a like. Thumbs up, subscribe, click that bell for notifications for future videos, and let's get into it. That's fine. Fire. That nigga tailgating right there. I'm gonna go ahead and click him. Just on the I'll be initiating 1011. Stand by for latest postal. 224 traffic, 098, Sonora Freeway northbound on a brand color four door sedan. I can part as well, no additional. I'm saying he probably needs to turn his on and off. Like the uh, in the pause menu. The uh. Oh my god. 147 Do you need me up there? I'm okay for right now. 10 4 I'll be heading Uh, just a little bit north of uh, Snow Freeway, um, past Joshua, 098. I get this nigga for following too closely. $25, I think. He's uh he's he's staying SVPD. All right, sir. So you're gonna be receiving a citation today. Okay. So when you passed us, I don't know if you saw us or not, but when you passed me um at that little rest area, and you crossed off of Joshua there, you were heavily tailgating the vehicle in front of you. That's extremely dangerous. Okay. When you're following too closely, then that minimizes your reaction time. So if the vehicle in front of you had to. For some reason, you know, slow down quickly or there was debris in the way and it swerved out of the way, you know, then you would have that late reaction and could potentially cause a chain reaction, okay? So just make sure you're being careful of that. Um, so here's your citation there. Sign at the bottom side of Mission of Guild, okay? Just for following too closely. The $125 citation. I get it, sir. I understand. Um, you know, unfortunately, I, I don't dictate how much these cost I know you know the economy right now is not great but unfortunately you know I have to do my job and you know, you're kind of being reckless there so next time just don't do it and you won't get the citation okay bud I appreciate it drive safe once I get back in my vehicle you'll be free to go okay thank you mr. cannon what's going on here 
Yeah, just super citation. He was following too closely, so I wanted to make sure that, uh, you know, he's aware of that, and hopefully that doesn't happen again. I remember. I will see you up. Yes, sir, you as well. 224, my traffic stop's gonna be code for one citation issued. Back to Nate. Uh, this is our next one. Double. You're fired, nigga. He definitely ran that light there. This one, I'm going to be initiating a traffic stop here on Joshua Road. Stand by for final stop. Traffic stops in code four. One citation given for spare license and speed. Go back to service. This one to 41147. Can I have you at my stop? 319 East Joshua. 104 in route code 2 high. This nigga be fine. <laughs> 1147 arriving on scene 319 East Joshua Road. How's it going? Howdy, howdy. Going good. Yeah, can't complain. What's going on here? Uh, nothing too crazy, actually. I just wanted you on scene just in case he did some, some weird shit. He ran that light there uh, across he, off of Union, and he crossed over to Joshua here, and he ran that light crossing somewhere oh. else. So, just wanted to have you here just in case. I was going to call an SVPD unit, but I'm like, you just finished your stop, and you're, like, right there, so why not? Yeah, you know, that's so. understandable. I have yeah. no to do, really. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to just talk with him real quick and see what's going on. Shouldn't be too crazy, so you, I might release you after about halfway through the stop, but I just wanted you here just in case, so. Yeah, I get you. All right. Appreciate it, man. No problem. Hello, ma'am. I'm the uh, colonel with the Senator State Police. I'm currently uh, the Motor Carrier Compliance Division. Uh, to your right is going to be uh, Trooper Harold there. He is the operating as the Highway Enforcement of Aggressive Traffic. Okay. So the reason for the stop, um, you ran that light there on Sonora Freeway. You were crossing off of Union, coming off to Joshua, and you ran that light. Uh, you were kind of speeding a little bit, trying to kind of looks like you were trying to beat the light, um, but unfortunately, you were unable to make that. So, you got your driver's license, registration, proof of insurance on you by chance. I appreciate that. Sit that for me. Hey, Harold. What's up? So, I just got a call of a stolen ambulance. I think I'm gonna take that. So, I'm gonna just let her go with a warning. She's lucky today. If you want to help uh, assist with me on that, yeah, I got you. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and give her information back. All right, ma'am. Today is your extremely very lucky day. I I hardly give breaks. Okay, I got a call that's a little bit more of a priority than this. Okay, so here's your information back. You need to slow down. Okay. Just because it turns yellow doesn't mean gun it and try and beat the light. You need to slow down when it goes yellow, okay? Here's your information back. And take care, okay? Thank you. Here, I'll carry on that call. I got you. I'm going to see if I can attach you via IPD real quick. This one before I've been route to a stolen ambulance call. I'm gonna have 1147 with me. I'm gonna be uh, on Snor Freeway off of Union. We are closing. Two to the four, I do have eyes on the vehicle. It's going to be going northbound in the southbound lanes of travel. Extremely reckless at this time. 
101 with this postal. Copy, making a left. He is going to be out taking primary. <laughs> Still going to westbound here. Got position on the floor. I'm caught up to you now. I'll retain call outs. We're going to be Union Road at this time, 108, heading into Grape Seed. Once we get Sonora Valley attached and on scene, we'll uh, attempt to get a pursuit intervention tactic, making a right onto Grape Seed Main Street, 121. Alright guys, so we are currently in pursuit of an ambulance at this time. Uh, we're going to have a heat unit primary. We got some Sonora Valley units in route. Once well, he gets away from the low more populated areas, I'm going to attempt to pit. Copy. If we can, let's, we can try and wait for SVPD. That way we can have some more units to put on my box. Yeah, for how far out is that CPD? Coming from Route 68. Damn, Route 68. Where are you, where are you coming from, Dave? No, not. Yeah. Copy, we're going to be on Seaview Road. Copy, you got eyes on us now. Seaview Road 104, headed towards Joshua Road. All right, 224 to 1147. Whenever you think it's safe, you can go ahead and go for a bit. God damn. It's a vessel, it's a vessel. Carry box. Hands, hands, bro, hands, hands. Ramon officers, final stop is going to be 096. Taking off on foot. Gonna be a white male, dark tank top. It looks to be a American flag shorts or pants. Running northbound 096, Grape Seed Avenue here. Running into the uh, farms area. Stop. Stop running, dude! Come here, hands, hands. We're gonna be running towards Grape Seed Avenue at this time 096. Stop running, bro. Where is I'm heading back for my vehicle. I'm going to try to intercept him. Copper, we're going to be in, a, in the canal right now. 096. Going for taser deployment. Taser, 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 bro. We, do we both did this thing? Taser deployment, taser deployment. 096. Hands, bro. On your knees. On your knees, bro. We're going to have one at taser point at this time. 096. Do not move, bro. I'm gonna slowly go in. This one I'm gonna have one to fifteen zero nine six. Holy shit, man! What's going on, bro? Like, why are you? Like, why are you running, bro? Well, I do know why you're running. I, I really want to ask you why you're, you start an ambulance, but before that, uh, you do have the right to me and sound like you can say or do you can and will be used against you in the court of law, okay? You got a right to an attorney if you can afford an attorney, then it won't be appointed to you by the state of San Andreas. Okay, so do you understand the rights that I read to you? Got you. All right. Um, here, I'm going to put him in your car. I'm going to search him first. And then SVPD, if you guys want to just get back, hopefully the car is still there. Um, and be. then we'll meet you guys back at the initial stop. Okay. So who's taking the paperwork? Um, I'll do paperwork. That's fine. Oh, okay, thank God. <laughs> yeah, I'll do, <laughs> I'll do paperwork. Well, and that, <laughs> that nigga. Yo, he really, <laughs> yo, he really left. Nah, he's wildin'. I got you. You need a okay. 
Do I need to get out? Uh, I think so, yeah. There we go. Appreciate the assist. No problem. Who's on the farm? Returning back to sea. Right, I'm gonna go ahead and book him. I got you. Yeah, um, wait, do I have a. Yeah, that's a. Yeah, I need to get it real quick. Aw, oh, you can't do this to me! Don't fucking trap me! Let's go! Okay, I got it. I appreciate it. He didn't have anything on his person besides a wallet, so I tend to adventures besides that, so Alright. I got you. I appreciate yeah, it. I'll take I'll take him down to SVP again, bro. Alright, sounds good. Thank you, sir. From anything in a vehicle, uh officer. Definitely at the moment. Okay. Is there nothing in the vehicle? Um I'll go ahead and Get a tow for it and figure out what's going on. Kind of investigate how it got stolen. Yeah, empty. Just yeah, normal stuff in it. Yeah. Okay. All right. So I, I guess that's a good thing. There's nothing stolen. There's nothing. Um, no pills or anything from the ambulance that he could have potentially grabbed. That's that was missing. That was missing. Oh. Yeah. Save some charges. Yeah. All right. Well, I, I'll get a tow for the vehicle. Um, if you would just want to consult with your supervisor and if you guys are clear to go, then to go, uh, you then guys can. If you guys, guys want to, when you guys want to stay for jurisdiction purposes, you guys can. Yeah. Um, but right. um, it's entirely up to you guys. So. All right, sounds good. I'll see you. What do you want to do? I got you. Which one for be? Code four. I'll be ten six for paperwork. And they got some dark tent right there. I'm about to. I'm gonna creep on this nigga for a little. Ah, <laughs> uh, he will pull off. He he knew I'll pull out on this nigga. <laughs> Two six nine, Joshua. He just made he just he just made a U turn though. He trying to avoid me. I'm gonna block him. Two twenty four. I'll be uh, initiating to them. Stand by for the final stop. Wow. He didn't hit me, but that nigga got closed. Fuck. 224, final stop, 282 East Joshua. I'm gonna be on a gray four door sedan, dark window tents, un unknown, I mean, the occupants. I'm gonna have one on one on my 1011. How's it going, sir? You mind rolling down your window for me? I can hardly even see inside the vehicle, man. I appreciate that. What's up, man? Alright, uh, I am Colonel Phil with the San Andreas State Police. Uh, the reason for the stop is for how dark your windows it is. Uh, okay. Um, I mean, not, like, yeah, not only him. <laughs> huh? I'm sorry, go ahead. Well, you passed me when I was at the fruit stand, right? I did. I.
saw you make a ride off of a panorama onto Joshua, that's when you first caught my attention. Um, so then I was going to pull you over, but then you stopped. I was like, oh, okay, well, you stopped, and then you made a U-turn. So I made my U-turn, and I lit you up. So is there any reason why you ducked off at that fruit stand and then made a U-turn as soon as I passed? Like, kind of oh, know. because I went the wrong way, man. You know how these ways GPS be? GPS tells you to turn one way, and then it tells you to relocate. So when I pulled over to the right, I seen you was following me. I was like, okay, let me just wait until he passes. Wait until it's safe to do that U-turn. For sure, I definitely understand. Yeah, uh, yeah. My, so my main concern was definitely the window tent. Not only the ones for the rear and the sides, but you do have a tent on your windshield. You can't have a tent on your windshield at all. Uh, to say that San Andreas can't mess with the front windshield at all. You can have like a, a stripe at the top, you know, for like the sun and whatnot, uh, but you can't have your entire windshield and did okay, so um, yeah, you got your driver's license, uh, registration proof of insurance on you by chance? Well, coincidence, my name is Hugo James. Um, I, I guess I was talking to you earlier. Um, I okay. never got my license back. Oh, you never got it back. Okay, yeah, I got I you. got it back, yeah. Okay, okay. All right, okay, I got you. Um, so you, you said Hugo James, and then what's your date of birth? James, yep. Uh, it's gonna be fucking 08-12-1997. Okay. Alright, Alright, Mr. James, just sit tough for me, okay, bud? Is there anything in the vehicle I should be concerned about? Any weapons, drugs, alcohol? No weapons, no anything. Okay. Alright. Give me one second, okay? I no problem. Alright. Alright, so... Simply just for the tent, nothing crazy he didn't really commit any other major traffic infraction he did make a u-turn but it was legal uh it wasn't over a, a double yellow um however he, he you know he, he did make it from the shoulder so i mean i'm not too too worried about it i mean it's you know it's up to you how, how you feel about that and i can proceed forward you know it's just kind of your area i mean personally i'm not really chipping too much U-turn, but uh, the tent, his name is Hugo James. Um, so I did speak with this guy earlier. Uh, he does have a warrant out of Los Santos. So he cut him loose earlier because it was a different county. But then I can really do about it since, you know, so far away. Um, so I was just going to run his information real quick. He said that earlier, I didn't take it, but I think somebody else might have taken the identification and never returned it back to him. Okay, I, I got you. I got you. I appreciate it. Um, and then I'll probably be testing his uh, his tent as well. So, at this point, would we notify Drew? He is one, or no? Since he's SVPD. Hey, how's it going? Going all right. How about yourself? I can't complain. Uh, so this guy currently has a warrant. So um, it's just warrant for questioning. So just wanted your assistance. We're gonna go ahead and sit 15 him, um, and then take him to SVPD station, and from there LSPD is gonna be en route to extradite him down to the. Uh, the mission row for questioning. So I just wanted you here to kind of assist, uh, just to make sure you don't oh. do anything crazy. So wait, so what's the reason for the warrant on questioning? It's what? it's all in the CAD. Um, oh. I could sit here and spend five minutes explaining it to you, but basically he just uh, we believe or suspect that he is uh, a potential suspect for a shooting that happened uh, a few days ago uh, that involved an officer. So. We have a warrant right. for our, yeah. We had a uh, I believe we had a, a victim statement, correct, Chief? Uh, Chief, there we had a victim statement, so kind of got some information. So we have a warrant for questioning for him. All right, I'm gonna get my vehicle move forward since yeah, you know, SVP, you know, left. Yep, you're good. Can you hear me, sir? Um, I can hear you. Yes, in Discord. No, I have a deafened right now. No, no, I was talking about. Yeah, I can hear. Uh, you. We can go ahead. You said what? I'm sorry. 
Guy Speedy's gonna, they're gonna come and get him, so we can go ahead. Okay, we can go ahead. Alright. Alright, we'll move forward then. Alright. I'll have him step out and whatnot. So hopefully this goes well. So yes. just be on y'all P's and Q's. Um, Ellis PD does would like to have you down uh, in Los Santos for, for questioning. Um, I did notify them that I have pulled you over again, uh, you know, since you know, we remain close communication with our, you know, neighboring departments. Um, but at this time, I'd like you to step out the vehicle for me. Okay. Okay, so earlier you told me that uh, it was just for questioning. You said as long as I'm up here and not causing no, you know, no problems, then I'm good because it's in another bor borough. What I said specifically is that at the time LSPD was unavailable to come get you. Okay. That that's okay. the reason why it wasn't a big issue. You could it's, contact it's, LSPD and tell them that I'll drive myself down there the same way that I went into the police station today over here. I'll drive myself down there. It gives me time to contact my lawyer, but I'm not getting out the car right now. I can hardly hear him. They have the choice whether they're going to come pick you up or not. If they're not going to pick you up, then there's no reason for us to hold you. When we come in contact with you again, we go through the same process. Are you going to come get them? X, Y, Z. That's up to them. They say they're going to come and get you. We're going to come and we're going to take you in. It's not a, it's not a matter of a decision on whether or not you want to drive yourself. X, Y, Z. You turn yourself in. It's, it's, a, it's depending on what the department wants to do. The warrant in the department. Okay, I understand where you're coming from. Like I said, um, I understand where you're coming from, but the thing is, right? Y'all have made a mistake of letting me go. Y'all could have just held me until someone came to pick me up. Y'all made a mistake of letting me go. Um, like I said, I'll happily go down to the police station myself, but I'm going to wait for my lawyer. You know what I'm saying? Um, that's that, 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 that problem. The we, problem with y'all letting me to, go is on y'all. take you in a test. Okay, we let you go, we caught you again, so now we're taking you into custody. You're, okay, so this is, became a, a, a stop for tent, and now it becomes, uh, you're taking me into custody. Correct, because like how he stated, we went through that same process that we did initially of contacting LSPD, letting them know what's going on. And at that point, at, at that point, they can decide as to whether they would like you to be extradited down to, you know, Los Santos or not. The initial time that that happened, they were unavailable. What the hell just happened? I have no idea. Interesting. But the initial time that that happened, they were currently unavailable and not able to, you know, get you transported. But now that we've came in contact with you again, um, we went through that same process again. And at this time, they would they would like you to 15. That way they can come and get you. And, okay, and so they could come get me. I, I'll stay right. here. I could stay here. They could come get me here. Well, we're going to take you to the, to the Sonora Valley Station first. And where's the Sonora? Uh, where, where's that at, man? Can I just at least park my vehicle? Your, your vehicle will, will be dealt with. I don't want my vehicle to be dealt with. I want to park my vehicle like how I came in earlier and park my vehicle so it won't get towed. I don't want to pay no okay, fees. Well, I, I, regardless, if you came to the station and you got transported then and there, your vehicle will still be getting towed regardless. Because your no, car is not Mark, your sadly, car is not gonna sit in our lot. Car not being towed is not an option at this point. Who is this guy behind? Who is him? I'm talking to you and, and you. Don't worry about it. You're talking to all of us right now. So no, I'm so no no I'm no, gonna no, need no, you to no, just listen. step out the vehicle please. You're talking to all three of us, man. <laughs> oh you're right. I you're right. Just come in cordially, man, you know, I know you want to turn yourself in earlier, you know, and I, unfortunately at the time we didn't have enough resources to make that happen. But now, you know, they're willing to come up here and come get you. So you can just easily just hop out your vehicle. We can get this all processed and, and, and good to go. You know what I mean? I'm not going to I'm not leaving. But I mean, do you understand, you know, what, what we're explained to you? I understand. I'm explained? not leaving. I'm not, not leaving. So now, so now you're what's... just dealing with a warrant. If you prolong this you can hit with resistant arrest and now you got to deal with that first as well so it's all right bro it's all right i i i try to be nice about it earlier and then i'm not i'll drive myself down there mm -hmm. so go ahead and hop out the car for come on mr james 
You right. know I'm not just, out the car. <laughs> it's just a war for questioning, bro. You don't. It's like just, just easily nope. just hop out the, hop out nope. the car, let me park bro. park my vehicle. Let me just park my car. Par you can park your car right here. We'll leave your car right here. No. Either you're gonna come out or we're gonna take you out. You see, I don't, I don't like that though. You see what I'm, I'm trying to, like, I just want to park my vehicle. Now look, if you don't like being taken out of the car, I suggest, suggest you get out on your own and leave your car right the fuck here. Simple as that. Simple as that. Come on, Mr. James. Don't, don't make this difficult, hard, anything like we're that. I'm not trying to add any extra charges. We don't know what you got going on with bus methods. I'm not trying to make it extra for you, but. We don't. We don't have one day to sit on the side of the road. All right, I'm coming out. I appreciate your cooperation, man, Mr. James. Give me a couple of minutes. Uh, I don't need you moving around in your car at all. I, I just need you out the vehicle. As simple as that, bro. I need okay. you moving around. Honestly, your vehicle should already be turned off by now. I just need you out the vehicle, my man. I'm coming out, <laughs> Mr. James. I feel like oh, you're fucking right. with us. Come on, man. Two twenty four. He's taking off. Two twenty four. Get LSP notified about this. Ten eighty at this time. Eastbound three zero zero Joshua Road. White four door sedan. Hugo James. Go for LSP. Still going eastbound Joshua Road, heading towards the North Freeway. Gonna we'll be going northbound on the North Freeway at this time. Your A8. Oh shit! Union Road, Union Road, you know what? Hey, Hold on, my screen. Hey, Union Road, Union Road, you know what? Hey, Out the way! Taking a left, left, left on CQ Road, CQ Road 110, 110. Doing speeds of over 100 miles an hour. Yeah, he's. <laughs> I, I, I wrecked. Golly. Made a ride onto Joshua Road 317 going westbound. Joshua Road into Sandy. Going over 100 miles an hour, running red lights. 300 late as postal, still westbound, Joshua Road. Copy. Still going westbound, 273. 273 westbound, Joshua Road, heading towards Stab City. One person, you want me to activate the Sorgata uh, station? A firm, A firm. Made a right onto Marina. He's still making rights, going on in circles at this time, going back towards Joshua. Made a left onto Joshua, going eastbound. Now you passed us. Uh, two five five, latest postal. Left route. We're gonna be on Gonkin Boulevard, headed into Sandy Shores, two seven three. On Gonkin Boulevard, making a right onto Panorama. Right onto Panorama, going eastbound. Now making a left. On to Zancudo and another left on to standby. I'm 10-0. He's going to be on Zancudo Ave. He's going to be going towards the hotel. I'm on side. Made a left on the panorama. Left on the panorama. Continuing for panorama. Going towards the LJ. Up lost eyes, passing yellow jack. I got him here, 277. 
Going back with the panorama towards Yellowjack. 278, gonna be. What is it? Southbound on Panorama Drive. Three zero five postal. He's gonna be going northbound and southbound lanes of Sonora Freeway. Northbound and southbound lanes of Sonora Freeway, heading towards U Tool. He just made a U turn, now going south and southbound lanes. He's making more U turns, going north and northbound lanes now. Three zero six. Two twenty four. I'll be secondary. Take it over. Call out. Still going northbound. Three zero seven. Sonora Freeway. He is going to be a primary. These are eight latest postal. Two twenty-four to eleven forty-seven. Whenever you get a chance, you can take him out. Step four, copy. He's been a little bit reckless here. Be advised. Just be careful here. Making a U-turn, going south and northbound lanes. He's crossing over. Also 323 going southbound Sonora Freeway. He's now going south and northbound lanes. Going south and northbound lanes, 313. He is going past the Joshua exit. Or correction, the Route 68 exit, 306. Still going southbound and northbound lanes. A unit is going to be right after him. Going to be taking the Los Santos uh, going nor uh, southbound on northbound lane. Making a U-turn. We're at the 358 northbound to North Freeway, to North Freeway northbound. And he's speed to the Val 100. Right, we got to be, we gotta be very, really, really, really so careful here. He's going to be in northbound and southbound lane. Gotta yeah, be taking the exit. Taking the exit. Gotta be extremely careful there. Copy. Back on the control through, man. I need to turn my radio up, bro. Gotta <laughs> be at the usual now. Pulse two zero eight two zero eight north south and south down lane. Going speed to well over a hundred miles an hour. Staying towards Joshua, it's kind of hard to keep up. She's still northbound southbound lanes. We're going to pull from 323. Copy. You get left, left, left on Joshua. Joshua Road, 220. 10 4, making a left now, Joshua Road. I do believe I lost eyes. Copy, where'd you lose eyes? Where'd you 10 0 on him? Right at the Joshua exit after he turned off. Copy, I'm gonna be going CV Road. I'm gonna locate. Or I'll be riding back towards that way. Copy. Um, unknown what the plate was on the vehicle. It could have been a stolen vehicle. Um, I'm not entirely sure. I didn't get a 1020 on it. But uh, RO is definitely going to be Hugo James. His warrant has upgraded from a questioning to now a warrant for an arrest for eluding and fleeing. For be advised, the description is going to be a four or more white sedan, unknown plate. Do we have a description of the mail inside the vehicle? Stand by description for Melon Speedy coming in. 30 seconds. Stand by 101. Description is going to be a black male. He has on the work uniform right now. Uh, it's going to be orange and green work uniform. He works for the garbage truck company. Stand board sad on suspect is known to be armed and dangerous. So be advised. Copy. All right, guys. So we unfortunately 10 0 on the subject, um, last known on Joshua Road uh, around this area. 224 be advised. Uh, definitely make sure we're checking alleyways. 
all the nooks and crannies. He can be anywhere in the area, possibly on foot. Uh, so just check every single area here. I'm gonna go back to 249. I got you. For westbound at 21 Boulevard, 292, passing the gunshot. Copy, in route. Almost to a stop. 455. Gonna be at a stop, 295, now going for Two eighty five, correct. Two eighty five. Eighty five, oh, Shots fired, shots fired, shots fired. One on one status. He's taking off, he's taking off. Gonna be going on Panorama Drive at this time. Made a left up to Zancudo. Going eastbound Zancudo, 283. 101, I'm taking them out. First pair of packs. Copy. Uh, 220. Yeah, we're just in circles at this time of uh, Sandy Shores. Passing the SVPD station, passing the hospital, 284. Going back with the panorama and then Joshua now. Uh, 275, eastbound Joshua. Clear, closing. Let's just be careful, guys. It's getting pretty dark as well. Traffic is a little light. 311 is the postal. 224, I'm third, so if I get secondary to take over, take over call outs. Taking primary at this time, zero nine zero East Joshua Road eastbound. Oh, fuck, fuck! Major ten fifty from the state, continuing down to North Bay. Damn. Southbound, opposite side. Kenny, somewhere three three one three three. Copy. I'm attempting to Copy. catch up. Blacked out. Blacked out. Almost hitting a vehicle. Continuing to North Freeway southbound. Postal three zero six. Continuing shooting three three down. Ah. Oh. Copy. Be advised, Copy. still continuing to North Freeway 360. Still opposite lane to travel. He's going to be jumping on the opposite side on that overpass. I'm continuing. Alright, just turn around to North Freeway, back north. Postal 366. Copy, I got eyes on him. 358. The advice suspect just ran into the guardrail, almost hitting, almost striking an officer vehicle. Continuing back northbound to North Freeway. Gonna be opposite lane to travel to North Freeway. Up. Oh. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Show me your hands, bro. Show me your hands. Why does my game freeze every time, bro? Show us your fucking hands, bro. Hands, do not move. Show us your hands. This one for I got one at gunpoint. All right, all right. You want to give commands? Uh, heat. Go ahead. Stop moving that. That stop moving that steering wheel, bro. God damn! He's got a gun, he's got a gun! Gun in hand, gun in hand. Drop the gun, drop the gun! Drop the gun! You're gonna get shot, bro! Drop the gun! Drop the gun, bro! I'm hit, I'm hit, I'm hit! Suspect down, suspect Do down. Do not move! Watch my six. I got you, I got you. Copy, I got you. I'm gonna be right back. I got you. 224, shots fired, shots fired, 360, shots fired. 
Just doing it for, I'm gonna set up a speed. Just I'm gonna get traffic slow down. Four fifty five, I'll be good. I'm just gonna apply a tourniquet to my arm here. Stop the bleeding. Get an EMS. Mr. James, you do know you already had a warrant, man, just for questioning. Now, you know, you've upgraded that. So you're, you're, you're definitely going to jail. I don't know how you're going to plead your case now, man, okay? So you do have the right to remain silent. Either you can say or do you can't ever be used against you in a court of law. Okay, you got a right to an attorney. If you can afford an attorney, they won't be appointed to you by the state of San Andreas with, with no cost. Okay? You understand the rights that I read to you. No, I don't. Can you repeat it one more time? I'm, I'm going to repeat them one more time for you, okay? You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say or do, can it will be used against you in the court of law. Okay? You have a right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, they won't be appointed to you by the state of San Andreas at no cost. Okay? You don't understand it? I read it. My body camera's on. I read it twice to you, See, clearly. Senor. Okay? See. Well, uh, Alright, so know. let's, uh, we'll just keep packing his wounds. County ah, EMS should be arriving here in about two mics. That is going to be the end of today's video, guys. I hope you all enjoyed what I have shown to you guys. Of course, the Rudder Blade 2.0. You know. Again, guys, this is my Fathom server, and if you did like what you saw today, definitely click the link to our Discord in the description, to our community Discord. Uh, feel free to, uh, you know, to apply. Give us a shot. Uh, we have Los Santos Police Department, San Andreas State Police, and civilian available to do everyone. That being said, give this video a thumbs up, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.